Right. For domains of functions, we have um, a few different rules. The only rule that's going on here is our division. Remember, if you're dividing by some quantity, then that quantity cannot be zero. So we're dividing here by one minus two cosine of x. And that thing cannot equal zero. Now if we add the two cosine of x over, oops, two cosine of x, and then divide by two, we get that cosine of x cannot equal one half. Now we should be very familiar with our unit circle. And so we should know that this happens at uh, pi over three plus two pi n, where n is an integer, or negative pi over three plus two pi n, again, where n is an integer. So this is our domain, and I'm going to write this in, uh, in set notation. So x can be in the set okay, um, of all, oh, actually I'm, actually, I'm just going to say this. is It's the set of all x uh, that are real numbers okay, such that, that's what the colon means, uh, x is not equal to pi over 3 plus 2 pi n, or negative pi over 3, plus 2 pi n, where n is an integer. Okay, this is set notation for a domain. x can be any real number as long as x is not one of these things. <clears throat> and that is the domain of this function.